everyone. Um, we've got a, 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 a dog patient here, Mishka. She, um, she, uh, she's an old girl, Shane. She, what she has actually been doing is um, she's been uh, nibbling at her paw. And, um, and uh, as a preventative, what the, uh, the owners were hoping to do is to, to stop her from, from getting to her paw, and, and they placed a sock um, over the, the leg. What they did, though, is they placed an elastic band um, to, to attach the sock. And um, unfortunately, what happens with, with dogs is they're very, very sensitive um, to, uh, to anything constricting the, the, the blood flow to, the, uh, to this area. And um, you, you would think that sort of with us, you know, we place an elastic band and it's not so bad. But dogs are in, in very, very sensitive to anything sort of very tight in this area because there's not a lot of tissue to work with. So unfortunately what has happened is it's actually constricted around the, the leg, caused quite a bit of swelling and quite a lot of injury. Now, the good thing is it's thankfully not too deep and, and she will be able to clean this up. It's all been shaved. Um, and uh, with with some uh, uh, sort of um, antibiotics and some cleaning, and that should settle down quickly. Um, but it's just very very important that when things are placed, they don't get left on for a long period of time. Um, and it's one of the reasons with bandages, we're also very very careful with uh, with not making them too tight around dogs' paws because they can cause this type of injury. But she should heal up okay from here.